The officials are ready. The fighters are in the ring. And they are ready. So for the thousands in attendance and the millions watching around the world, ladies and gentlemen, uh, let's get ready to rumble! All right, guys, let's get right into it. Mershon Akhmagdali have punched his way into contention for the division's top prize. The dethroned unified WBA IBF junior featherweight titleist battered previously unbeaten Kevin Gonzalez in route to an eighth round knockout stoppage. Akhmagdali have scored two knockdowns each in round six and eight. The fourth and final knockdown produced an immediate stoppage at two minutes 48 seconds of the eighth round in their WBA title eliminator Saturday evening at Dinner's Diamond Arena in Glendale, Arizona. Akhmagdali have vowed to jump out of a quicker start a lesson he claimed that he learned in stunning defeat to Marlon Topolis earlier this year. The setback not only ended his three-year WBA IBF junior featherweight title reign, but cost him a shot at fully unifying the division versus WBC WBO champion area in a way whom Topolis will face later this month in Tokyo. That promise was well intended, but Gonzalez also had a say in not allowing the Uzbek Southpaw to enjoy an early lead. The fighting pride of Kuliakan landed straight left hands in the opening round while Akhmagdaliev connected with counter right hooks but seemed to be a step behind. Akhmagdaliev picked up the pace in round two and was quicker to the draw. Gonzalez still found a home for his left hand out of the Southpaw stance. It was still wasn't enough. At the start of the seventh, the threat of a stoppage was raised, but Gonzalez begged for at least one more round to turn the tide. He made it through the seventh relatedly unscathed, after which Panda insisted that Akhmagdali have already offered his best. However, he also disclaimed that he needed to see more improvement from Gonzalez or else he would pull the plug. Akhmagdaliev made the call that the corner failed to do. The heart was there for Gonzalez, but the fight was beaten out of him by that point. Akhmagdaliev methodically picked apart his battered foe and scored the third knockdown of the night with a vicious left uppercut. Gonzalez once again beat the count and was permitted to continue, but a follow up power punching barrage by Akhmagdaliev forced the stoppage. Gonzalez fell to 26 wins, one loss, one draw, 13 by way of knockout with his first career defeat. Akhmagdaliev advanced to 12 wins, one loss, nine by way of knockout with the win. He is now the WBA mandatory contender, but will have to wait for his shot at his old title. The Inouye Topolis winner is required to next face former two division titleist Luis Neri as the overdue WBC mandatory challenge. Guys, what did you think about uh, Akhmagdalia versus Kevin Gonzalez? You know, Kevin Gonzalez is with Team Subrail Matias and Fresh Productions. Coach Panda on his side. Akhmagdaliev was just too much for Kevin Gonzalez last night. You know, we don't even know how he lost to Topolis. Akhmagdaliev is good. He's real good. Um, so, uh, you know, let's see what's next for him. Perhaps Lewis Nuri. Uh, I know that he wants a shot at those titles. You know, I know he wants a big shot at those titles. So we'll see what happens with In Away and Topolis. And then I guess come 2024. We might have a few bangers on our hands. Guys, let us know in the comments below what you thought about the fight. You can find us on Instagram at Sportbox TV, official X for me, known as Twitter at Sportbox TV. And of course, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and also share the vid. We appreciate all love and support. Take care.